Hey guys, Brett and I, Millimeter USA here, and today's video is going to be on the Colt Gold Cup Trophy model. So this is a uh, newer rendition of a Colt. I think this was bought in like 2015, 2016-ish. So it's a newer Colt 1911 here. Really rough safety, I noticed that right off the gate here. Slide to frame fitment isn't terrible. There's a little bit of movement. I did notice in this Colt National Match Barrel, there is no movement at all in it, okay? So that's nice. This trigger does have a very wide width to it. It's like twice the size of a regular 1911 trigger. Maybe not twice, but 25% larger overall in circumference to really get a good uh, press on that pad of your finger. The trigger on it, really good reset from full press here. A little bit of uptake, hit the wall, clean break. A uh, little bit of movement up and down, a little bit of movement side to side. Uh, it has the less bear style uh, beaver tail, how it's fit to the frame. Like that a lot. All right, let's shoot this thing. Wilson Combat ETM mag. This Light 11 hasn't been sighted in yet, so it's hitting low for me, but it's still hitting center. So I had to aim upper chest to hit near the stomach. Uh, another mag here. Safety on here. It has Bomar style sights as far as the adjustable rear sight, just like a Les Baron 1911, and a very nice high visibility red fiber front sight. All right, shoot some more. Single hand fire. Two hand again. Through that shot. Another mag. Failed to uh, feed right there and it got in. Alright. Not bad. Brett is senior, see what you think of it. Yeah, I'm looking forward to shooting it, guys. It's been a long time since I've shot a Colt 1911. The last one I owned was a Delta Elite 10 millimeter in. 1988, more shooting to come. All right guys, the Colt Gold Cup Trophy. Again, I haven't shot a Colt, wow, 30 years. I do like the wider trigger on it already. I was messing with it a little bit. I do like the wider trigger on it. Let's see if I can hit anything with it. Failure. Where am I going? It hits low. It hits Aim low? upper. Need a slight adjustment to the sights here. Let me try to go 21 yards away here. Failure. About half hits, half misses there. The sights are off a little bit. I'm not exactly sure where. It's had a couple of uh, sluggish feeds. So again, I think that may be a, a new recoil spring needed. I'll go to the green target in the middle, 18 yards away. Did it again. Again. Okay, my finger's pulling back on the trigger. The round is at the feed ramp, but it's not going in. Smack the back of it. Well, I've been hitting back yeah. here, and it's feeding it. Okay. 
Finger still on the trigger. I'm going to let up for the reset. And that's it. Okay, so I think a, a slight adjustment to the sights is needed, and then I think also a new recoil spring. I would go with uh, a Wilson Combat, like an 18-pounder or something like that. I'll talk to the owner of this Colt and ask him to do a little bit of research on a new spring system from Wilson Combat, make that change, and I think we're good to go. Other than that, you know, it shot pretty good, considering I haven't shot one in a long time. All right, guys, that's it here on the Colt Gold Cup Trophy in 45 ACP. Thanks for watching the video. Remember to like, share, and subscribe to our channel here on YouTube, Brett and I, Millimeter USA, for more guns and gear videos coming up in the future.